Good afternoon from Universal Orlando Resort. We're here again for Mardi Gras food and festivities. We yeah. got the parade tonight. I'm super excited. Yeah, we're going to watch it. We're not going to be on it. No, maybe another time we'll be yeah. on it. But anyway, we're inviting you guys to join us. So if you're ready to go dance the night away. Feet don't fail me now. Feet don't <laughs> fail me now. Let's go. <laughs> well, it seems like we picked a pretty good day to taste some food. The boots have no weight. So I got the Nikuma bun sampler. So it's a soft trio of fluffy sesame seed bun filled with char siu pork, teriyaki chicken, and sweet coconut. I did not think about that one. <laughs> but I'm hungry, so I'm gonna try it. I'm assuming that's coconut, I could be wrong. Which one? I mean, it's white, right? You never know. Which one's that? It's the pork. That's the pork one? Mm -hmm. It's very good. Well, let's um, take a look in the it's inside. not the softest filling ever. Okay. And you can see where they like put the... Oh yeah, you're right. <laughs> they kind of plugged it. I'll try a little bit of both so you don't have to watch me eat the whole thing. Okay. Let's see, what's this? Sweet coconut. That's the sweet coconut one? It's all right. <laughs> well, you want to see the inside? Yeah, maybe you can try that one, but... I don't like coconut. I might try actually, it. it's got like a cinnamony-ish taste to it too, so it's actually not terrible. I might try it out. That's the teriyaki chicken. Mm. That one's the best one. Both of these two are pretty good. Yeah. They're just like, I've had softer bao buns before, mm. but it's a theme park, so. You know. Sure. But you want to try the coconut? I might try the coconut one. I'm yeah. gonna try your coconut one that you don't like. Ooh, that's good. Like, it's not terrible, but it's definitely got them flakies in there. Yeah, the coconut flakes? Yeah. I'll eat this. Okay, eat it. Mmm. I call the rest of it, though. So we got the potato pancakes, which are crispy potato and parsnip pancake with apple butter and sour cream. That sounds so good. Then we got the chicken schnitzel with capetzel. Fried chicken thigh cutlet served with baked spatzel and beer sauce cheese. So it's like mac and cheese, but a little different, so. All right, I'm excited. Ah. Can't wait. Cool. All right, do you want to do this chicken schnitzel first? Well, you haven't eaten yet, so you you eat okay. something. You gave me two knives, thank you. Yes. <laughs> That's where we're at. I'm gonna do the chicken schnitzel first. I wanna try this. It looks good. It sounds good, like it's the crunch. Crispy. Very bad for you. Look at all that grease. Mm, yeah. yeah. Now I want some. That's how it's supposed to be. Crunchy and delicious. That's good. Yeah. Okay, Universal. <laughs> so now, what do you think? Good? It's a big cut. Tastes better than uh, some other ones I've had. Mm. You want to you want to squeeze some lemon on it? Doesn't matter. Please. Mm. Get that seed off there though. Now I want to try this mac and cheese wannabe. Well, what is this? Spatzel. What is that? Noodles and beer cheese, I think. I think. Let's try it. Okay, so we're gonna try the beer cheese mac and cheese thing. Spatzel. 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 Whatever that is. Never heard of it. But it looks good and it smells good. Very cheesy. I love a good crunchy side mac and cheese. There's something else in there. It's like an herb or something. Ooh, it's Probably. got like a little kick to it. Yeah. That's pretty good. I like the chicken better though, I think. It's pretty good. I wish they gave you a bigger little, I mean, it's a good side, but. This chicken central is good. Yeah. I'm gonna get some more of that. And it's not well. too dry. No, it's good. Oh. So far, that's the best food we've had, but we've just begun. Yeah. Now, got digging into this pancake. So I'm interested in this. It's basically a hash brown. It's with apple sauce. A hash brown with applesauce on it. 
What? That's weird. Why? It's a weird flavor. It's like salty, but sweet. It's essentially applesauce. So a few years ago, I believe they did it at Epcot. They do it at Epcot, I think, yeah. every year. And I feel like this is a better, more accurate version of what it's supposed to be than the one at Epcot. Weird, right? I like this better. <laughs> what do you, well, how would you describe that? It's salty. But sweet, sweet, salty. Um, it's like you if you dip a french fry in applesauce. <laughs> Hash browns in applesauce, but you don't like you don't like sour cream, right? Not a big fan of sour cream. All right, well, I'm gonna try it with the sour cream. I just wanted to get it out of the way for you. That is weird. I feel like um, Epcot did a potato pancake and they did it just like this, with the ap literal applesauce on top of it. Mm, I feel um, like this is what it's supposed to taste like. I like it better without the sour cream, to be honest with you. I'm gonna try it with the sour cream, even though I hate it. Yeah. Don't do it. Yeah, sour. see, I didn't like it with the sour cream. <laughs> Would I get it again? No. But it's different. But next time, you can ask it without sour cream. I still don't think it's it's a dish that I would be that excited yeah. about. The chicken schnitzel and the mac and cheese wannabe thing. Very is good. Much better. It's it it is, yeah. It's chicken too. And it's better with the lemon on it too. It's a big cut. Because I've done gone to like. German festivals and stuff mm. back home in New Jersey, and like this is how it is. Yeah. So it's very so good. So far, Germany gets the win. Mm -hmm. There's still more boots to try. Yeah. So let's go. So this is the berries and cream waffle, and look how beautiful she did it. I was not expecting this when I got it. Like you said, it's glistening. It's in glistening in the sunshine. <laughs> I hate to actually mess it up, but here we go. But I'm gonna mess it up anyway. Oh God, maybe you should have went first. Cause the plate's so small that I'm like, I'm gonna knock it all off of it. Oh my God, that's good. <laughs> I think after you almost got the s'mores one too. But you settled for want, the berries and cream. Cause I didn't want to eat it all. I wanted to share and you won't eat s'mores. <laughs> good. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Best dessert mm, so mm. far. It's the only dessert. Well, besides that coconut thing. Yeah, I'd agree. This is so good. Have it. Try. Yeah. All right. Before I eat it all. <laughs> He's Ooh, digging it's, in. It's like coated in sugar. It's so good. Is it like the um? Yes. The one at Creations Cafe. Yes. Whatever? Yeah. Because that one's really good, but I think you get more for this one. <laughs> I now want the s'mores one <laughs> really bad. So good. Why do those strawberries taste so fresh? They maybe they went fresh. I don't know. Why'd wow. you add more whipped cream there when there's enough whipped cream? I know. This is good. So good. Did they have this last year? I don't know. I don't, I don't think I had it, so I don't think so. Oh come on, stop eating. I want some. Mm. <laughs> so good. Mm. Mm. What I like about these Luigi waffles. At the waffle themselves, They're like coated in that sugar. Yeah. So they have like a crunch to it. Yep. Pretty good. So good. I like it. <laughs> you know what? I think they put sugar on the um, strawberries. You think so? Mm hmm. Because I used to do that as a kid and like that's what it tastes Gives like. It the extra yeah. Sweetness. Mm -hmm. You're probably right. It was good though. Mm hmm. I have to come back for the s'mores one. <laughs> Okay, so we got the arepas de queso, which is white corn masa cake with queso blanco, which is white cheese on top. And then they gave me this like, I don't know what this is, but it's it like smells. Pesto? It smells like salsa. Like white, or uh, green salsa. So I'm gonna try, I'm actually gonna dip it in. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna dip this. I wanna try this. See how this comes out. Whoa. <laughs> There's jalapenos in there. Oh. But it's actually pretty good. So, if you just have normal arepas with white cheese, it They're doesn't have a lot of flavor. Bland, right? Kind of, yeah. So, what's nice about it is it kind of absorbs all the liquid. 
problem? I'm good. I'm good. Thank you. I appreciate it. I think I got it. <clears throat> As a reference, it was down the wrong bike. Uh, I think I got it last year, but it didn't come with it. No, no, I don't remember that. There's That's like what tomatoes, it looks like. There's there's jalapenos, yeah. there's stuff in there. I don't know. It doesn't actually, that part doesn't say on the menu what it is. Oh, yeah. I don't know. But it actually goes pretty well with this. Is it worth $8.50? Probably. No. What? Yeah. Eight forty nine. A little pricey. Yeah. For white corn. Yeah. 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 So I happen to notice that right over there is where they're having some of the animal actors out for Animal Actors, which is the show that's normally performed right here. I mean, they, they come out afterwards. Oh, is that it? Yeah. Okay. So we saw what looked like a dog and a skunk. Yeah, we saw. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, we gotta go check it out. We gotta let's go, check go out the skunk. see the Have skunk. You ever a skunk. No. Today's your first day. <laughs> Hopefully, we'll see. Hi. So this is Paisley. She's one of our skunks here. Oh. You can touch her, and we're back. Oh, oh, softer than I thought. Mm -hmm. For real. Oh, yeah, hi so she's there. About seven. Aww. They can live up to about 16 years old. Wow, look at you. You're so pretty. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Aww. Thank you. Oh, That's cool. That's cool. So we met a skunk. Uh -huh. His name was Paisley. I didn't ask you if you wanted to pet That's a skunk. That's fine. I'm good not petting a skunk. I pet a skunk. You love petting animals. In yeah. <laughs> and I've never. That's very much softer than I expected. Paisley was pretty cute. Paisley was like, oh, I just kind of want to leave. <laughs> <laughs> she looked like she was tired. Yeah, yeah. I think it's the last show of the day. Yeah, so. I'm ready to go in. <laughs> starting to get louder here. Yeah. You know that the party's starting to warm up and we got our beignets to end it. Actually, it's four. Oh, cool. Four beignets. Four beignets, smaller than the years. And not, no sauce. No sauce. So they're scaling down the beignets. But anyway, here we go. Pretty empty. Yeah. Not very fluffy. No, they're not. I mean, I forget the price. It's like five or six bucks. Yeah. You get four. And you get a pass holder discount. That's true. But I feel like it's a staple. Like yeah. you gotta have it. But if I had to say, the best dessert, go to the belt. Oh, so get good. A dessert out of that. So, so good. So we ended up going back to the Belgian dude. I couldn't not get Jan it. had to get her so Everything's much. been so good today. I was like, I can't not get it. So here I go. It's all me. The s'mores liege waffle. They made it so pretty again. And it was a different lady. Oh no, I feel like that's gonna fall. Okay. It's good. Uh oh. I think the other one's better though because it's really? such fresh fruit. You like the fruit one? Yeah. But it's still really good. Like it's got marshmallow in it and whipped cream and graham cracker and chocolate. It's got a little bit of everything. Yeah, it's really good. So of all the food we've had, which one is the winner? For savory food, it's the schnitzel for sure. The Germany? That was so good. And then the fruit waffle was so good. This is good too though. I'm happy. So get this. Don't go get the be uh, beignets unless you really want it. This is yeah. where the real dessert is. Yeah, this is where the like the artistry of uh, <laughs> of waffle s'more, making. Waffle s'more making. <laughs> we set up camp just outside the tribute store because this is where we're gonna view the parade tonight. What is it? Beads and brass. <laughs> Here come the motorcycle cops. They like it. Yeah. 
I got it. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> she fired. Oh. Oh. She dropped it. You cheated. You got that off the ground. Ground beads are just as good. No.
right for my face. <laughs> I saved your life. <laughs> the king and queen go! That's gonna do it for us here at Universal Studios Florida. Yeah. Where we got to experience the food. Yeah. And the parade. Yeah. And we got a lot of beads. It was super fun. And this festival runs all the way until April 16th. So long. Which is a long time. festival. It's a very long festival. Longer than festival. I think it's a little bit over two months. But it's super, a great time. Super good food. Love the food. What was your favorite booth? The, the Germany booth. Germany booth, oh I'm with God, you on that. that was so Germany good. Germany was probably my favorite of all the yeah. food options. And I think Belgium had the best desserts. Yes. So yes. you don't really need to leave that little pocket where Just they're both next to each bounce other. Bounce back and forth. Just go to those places. Yeah. But no, it was super fun. Parade was awesome. What'd you mm -hmm. think of the fantasy theme? I loved it. I yeah. thought it was cool. Yeah. I like fantasy things. Like Favorite float? Um, pro The Phoenix was really Phoenix cool. Phoenix was cool. I think I like the Phoenix and the Dragon. Those the two Dragon were really cool. too, yeah. And of course King Gator. Duh. Duh. Anyway, the King. <laughs> if you enjoyed the video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't yet, and you want to join our adventures for future trips to Universal and Disney and all the stuff around Orlando, tell them what to do. Make sure to tap that subscribe button and tap that notification bell to become a super bee catcher subscriber. <laughs> and until next time, see, see you real soon. soon.